Hi guys, I want to show you how to record 1080p 60 frames per second while you are streaming 70, 720p 60 frames per second on Twitch. So I'm using XSplit. So there are two screens that you should look at. One is above here um, where my mouse is. So here on the right hand corner, you should uh, have a drop down menu. Click on it and then change the resolution to um, 1080p 60 frames per second and you go to broadcast twitch and click the gear on the side and here you can see um, what's it the options here so this thing you should it should look somewhat similar it should be x264 bitrate 2000 um, mode CBR and now you click on this gear thing let's bring this up here um, check on strict CBR uh, keyframe max keyframe should be 2 and then in quarter preset um, so this is kind of I, it just feels like it's not really delivering how it's supposed to be if it's at uh, super fast ultra fast these are not good you would think like, oh, in quarter preset, you want it to be ultra fast. That sounds really good. No, actually, you want if you have the top, uh, top end computer, then you want to have it slow. Um, but to be safe, uh, you I just put it in fast. So what it does is that it uh, makes your CPU work harder to get the most frame in the game recorded scene so if you see some frame skipping here and there maybe your setting is at ultra fast so you might want to kind of play with it a little bit and see how far you can go and for me um, some people say you can actually put it down to medium and it works fine but I just put on fast so that I don't run into troubles so that's important and if you VBV buffer at 2000. So this is really important now. Um, video FPS, just put it on default. Um, if you've set it on to 30, then it's always going to be at 30 FPS. But if you're playing 60 FPS game, then it would automatically, I think, go to 60. At least that is, at least that is my understanding. And then the, for the video size, you have to set it to... Um, 1280 by 720 or 720p in this drop down menu, not 1080p. It, the reason being is um, Twitch does not have enough bandwidth at the moment to stream 1080p game. So this is easy and then you just kind of click away. And the settings should be saved. Um, I but we'll unclick the automatically save recording on local drive because um, let's close this now um, when you stream you don't want to uh, have two recorded file one when you have when you have that option uh, tick mark then you're gonna have a look automatically recorded file that's going to be in 720p um, but when you're running a game and you press the local recording short key or you press that local recording key um, while you're streaming then that local recording file will be in 1080p so you don't need two files of one recorded in 1080p and one recorded in 720p so just make sure to remember when you're streaming press the local recording key and you should be good to go um, it was a quick tutorial I hope you guys enjoyed it i hope i helped some of you out there i know many people knew about this except me apparently and i've been i've been posting all videos in 720p because i had no idea how to figure it out and when i was kind of looking to how to fix it not that many people kind of answered it or in any video form so they just said oh it's really easy to do it in XSplit, and that was their explanation. So I'm like, what? How do I do it? But I figured it out. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed it. I will see you guys next time. Goodbye.